you like about the performance and what do you want to see tweaks going into tomorrow's game? No, I'm not going to talk about tweaks, but we'll talk about last night's game. I, um, I, I thought both teams uh, had a chance uh, through the middle part of the game. They were winning the special teams battle. Uh, Urs gives us a chance in the second period, killing that one penalty with some of the saves he made at the end of the second period. And we kept playing and found our way. So uh, uh, I, I thought it was a good win as we start uh, our, our road trip here after the break. I know when we spoke or prior to uh, leaving uh, Philly, Carter Hart, the, the expectation was that he's going to play in tomorrow's game. Is he still on track to, to play tomorrow? Still, still progressing. Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to give you the goalie for tomorrow, but uh, uh, working out today, he's still progressing fine. Okay, he's progressing fine. Is when or what, what is kind of like the next step in the protocol for him? The next step for him is, is the evaluation, which I think he had this morning. I uh, haven't talked to anybody about it. No one's talked to me about it, so he'll go on the ice and just keep on practicing. We'll see where he's at. So you don't know if he's cleared or not yet for tomorrow's game? He's progressing. I haven't talked. To him. I, haven't just, I haven't seen Tommy this morning. You shuffled the lines in the third period. Um, afterwards, what was kind of the thought process of who you wanted to see together and the lines that you It wasn't with? who I wanted to see together. I was just looking to try to spark some offense. Uh, I, don't, I don't think we were creating enough um, and just trying to, uh, trying to help out, trying to see if we can get a combination together. As you kind of shuffle the deep pairs and you put some different players together, how well do you feel like the team has maintained the defensive structure that you saw today? We were better last night. I, I, I think uh, going into last night's game was a point of emphasis during our meetings prior to the game. The past three or four games prior to the break, uh, we were giving up too many chances. I, I think we were creating more chances, uh, but we were giving up too many. And uh, uh, I don't think we were stiff enough uh, um, and that's just not the defense, the defensemen, it's our whole team. I thought we were better last night and uh, um, haven't totally completed the tape, but I think we probably gave them 13, 14 chances. And that's where I like to see us at, in that area there. And uh, so we improved there. Uh, we'll play a, a better offensive team uh, come tomorrow. Uh, it'll be a good test for us. Coach, after a week off, how much can an overtime one be a confidence booster for this team moving forward? Well, just just an overtime win because uh, we've struggled so badly. Uh, well, I, actually, I don't think we've struggled the past two or three overtimes. We've had the puck most of the time. We just haven't been able to complete the game. And uh, again, last night we have the puck. Uh, uh, had a couple of line changes. Still had the puck. We were smart with it. Uh, and we find a way to win. I, I think that's important for their psyche. Uh, you come back from being down one nothing. 2-1, 3-1, two goals in the third period and win a game. That's important for them to, to feel good about uh, with a team that hasn't had a lot to feel good about. So, uh, uh, yeah, I give them a good day. We'll have a little workout here this morning to move the blood. They'll feel good about themselves, play an afternoon game, which is great, and see where we go.